Uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> we can be best buddies. Uh -huh. Good morning, everyone. I'm super excited about today because it is Jacob's birthday. He is 14 years old today. For breakfast, he wanted unlimited chocolate chip pancakes with whipped cream. So. Yeah! Whipped cream! Yeah! And as you can hear, that was a popular choice. It is your birthday. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling pretty good. I'm yeah. excited about today. It means my birthday's next. Yes, this does mean that your birthday's yeah. next. But let's celebrate Jacob's while it's his birthday, okay? Okay. All right. What is your big plan for today? My big plan for the day is to go to Universal Studios. I'm gonna go on the tram tour. Nice. Me too. Do you like the tram tour? Yeah. You do? No, with the shark in it. With the shark in it? Uh-huh, and then, then I go with it. Then the other shark. Another shark? Oh yeah, there are two sharks in that ride, huh? Uh -huh. I'll be able to go on the Flight of the Hippogriff with you. Oh, today! Today! Yes. Today, I can do it! And Jacob actually requested that he goes on this ride with you, Luke, today. Yeah, Luke. Because you're old enough. Now, I'm old enough now. And yeah, you can enough. go. you're old enough to take him on some of the bigger rides. <laughs> Oh, on the pet ride awesome. with you too. Yeah. The pet. Maybe. Depends yeah. on what we can do, but hopefully, hopefully the pet ride as well. Yeah, on your birthday. Mhm. Mm yeah. <laughs> we can be best buddies. Mhm. Mm birthday buddies. Jacob is pointing out that he is now old enough to take little kids on some of the rides at Universal. You have to be 14 or older to go with a little kid. Like that, that counts as an adult. So Jacob is an adult today. Jacob's able to take me on the mummy ride. And I'm yeah. very tiny. <laughs> I'm actually tall for my age, but you can't see me on the camera because the camera's so high. Because I'm very tall. Oh, Jacob. I got you this present with mommy. And with me. Actually, yeah, Luke was there too. Oh, cool. Ooh. Open it. Open it. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to do it this way. Me too. Let's see. Me too. I'm shaking. <laughs> what is it? It's a charger. Charger. We always need chargers. Uh huh. Huh. It's for my for my birthday. This one's for Jacob. I think I know what this is. Pretty big deal. Ooh. It's an Apple Watch. <laughs> Is it all set up already? Yeah? Yeah. Well, kind of. I don't know how charged it is. I hope it's charged for the day, but I don't know. Oh, that's smooth. You can charge it in the car. That's smooth. That's oh, some yeah. smooth business. What? I want to feel. Can I feel? Can I feel? What do you think, Jake? Oh, she's beautiful. This is really cool. I that is was cool. not expecting this. <laughs> yeah. I was not expecting this. I'm gonna get a watch. Look at that. Yeah, now you and Jacob match. You both have watches. Yeah, let's see your watch. I have a watch too. Oh. I know. We did the Apple logo. All right, we are at Universal Studios now. Well, not quite. We're we're in the City Walk, but I wanted to show this because Jacob wants to eat here tonight. That's a new restaurant. It used to be the Hard Rock, and now it's what is it? 
Toothsome Chocolate Emporium. I have eaten, or ate, I guess is the correct term, <laughs> in that restaurant there. Before, it was the Chocolate Emporium. So we have reservations for that tonight. So, it's, I'm, I'm excited. I like eating at new places. Yeah. Especially ones with chocolate in the title. And steampunk looking. And steampunk stuff. looking. I hear there's like a robot. No spoilers yet. We have arrived at Universal Studios. Jacob is obsessed with filmmaking, wants to be a director when he grows up, and he really wanted to go to Universal Studios Hollywood for his birthday. So we are here today. I'm so excited. And it is very, very hot. So that's one thing to note. <laughs> I think it's a little bit over 90 degrees. I don't know, it's hot. And Halloween Horror Nights has started. It's not going on during the day, but it's it, ha it starts like in the evening and we don't have tickets for that. So far, our kids don't have any interest. Bailey's kind of toying with the idea and I was like, I'll go with you this year if you want. Christopher does not like those things at all. And I don't know, I might really not like them. <laughs> but I'm willing to try it. Um, but we're not doing that today. And instead, we're doing something else that Jacob has always dreamed of. And we are going to the Chocolate Emporium restaurant that's in the Universal City Walk. I already have reservations for that. I am really, really looking forward to that as well. None of us have ever been and it looks really cool. So that'll be at the end of the night and I'm, I'm really looking forward to that and so is he. Jacob, are you excited about the Chocolate Emporium? Yes, very excited I about it. I am too. <laughs> the first ride Jacob wants to go on today is the studio tour tram ride. With Jimmy Fallon. With Jimmy Fallon, yes. The host of Late Night and SNL star Jimmy Fallon. That's his name. Yes. Are, Are you, you sleepy? You want to take a nap? You can take a nap on Dad. Night night. So kind of funny, usually on that tour, they take you past the, the set for Back to the Future. And so last night, Jacob and Bailey saw Back to the Future for the first time getting prepared to come here. And uh, and they skipped that part today. They were filming a commercial there or something, so we didn't get to see it, but we've seen it in the past, so it was cool to watch the movie last night. Did you like Back to the Future? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why is it a question? The parts of it that made me feel extremely uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Jacob, what's your review? It was good. Um, the story is good, except there's just a lot of plot holes. That, it was really funny because Jake was watching it and he was like, oh no, he's messing everything up. Like every step of the way, he's like, oh no, what has he done? <laughs> like the whole movie. The whole movie. The whole movie. That messed up everything. Yeah. And should have messed up more. So for lunch, Jacob wanted to eat at Three Broomsticks, which is in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And it's a very cool building. There's lots of like bridges and stairs that go nowhere. I got Jacob a present, and so he's gonna open it. It's very well wrapped, as you can see. This glorious bag, which has Harry Potter on it. They're fizzing whizbees. Whizbees. Fizzing whizbees. Fizzing whizbees. 
made with chocolate fizzy chocolate fizzy fruits. Thank you, Bailey. One of the main things Jacob wanted to do today was go on the secret life of pets with Luke, because it's like Luke's favorite ride here. And I think something very exciting is happening. I think Teddy, this is the first day, I think, he'll be tall enough to go on this ride. Well, any ride, really. But any ride here, really, yeah. I think, what, I think he's been on one ride. He's been on the tram tour, and he's been on the little bugs that the go bugs. up and down, yeah. Jake, let's show how tall you are. Today's your big day. Stand up straight. Oh! You did it! You want to go on the ride? <laughs> okay. <laughs> and in an interesting turn of events, we're riding together in our own car. She's just mad because she's not a dog. It's going to be fun. Oh, that doggy is me, and that's Jessica. Hi, hello, hello. Teddy's in there with Bailey. Parker and Duncan are in there. And then Jacob and Luke are way over there. Did you like the ride? Yeah, I got wet. You got wet? Oh my goodness. You like the doggy ride? This theme park is separated into two sections, the upper lot and the lower lot. And you have to go down four escalators to get to the lower lot. The lower lot has the Super Mario World, and it also has the Mummy and Jurassic World, and Transformers. So right now we're going down to the lower lot to go on some big kid rides. We're about to go on the ride, The Mummy, and we're hitting another milestone here because Duncan is tall enough for The Mummy today. He's never been tall enough for The Mummy before, but he's tall enough today, so... Jacob, you're just bringing a bunch of people on rides for their first time. That's, that's what I'm doing. How did you end up liking The Mummy? What was your favorite thing about it? Bugs. You like the bugs? That was your favorite thing about it? And also going backwards. Going backwards? That part's surprising, isn't it? Were you surprised when the wall was there and there was nowhere else to go? I've never been on this ride before, and Jacob wanted me to go on it today. So, we're Team Mario. That ride was so weird. I liked it, but it was so weird. You're like basically playing a game, and there's screens and real things, and then stuff that's like not actually there, that's like floating around. It's, it's weird. It's strange. But that's one ride that I've never been on that Jacob, again, bringing someone for their first time on a ride today. All right, so we just came to the top level up all the escalators, except one of us did not make it onto the escalator. He decided to take the stairs instead. You did stairs the whole way up here? I did the escalator once, but I did stairs. How, how did that go? Good? You got a lot of energy, dude. Must be all that gymnastics. I need more. Need a little break? No? Just gonna go for it? Okay, all right. Kind of cool taking the escalators right now because you can see all the construction that they're doing on the new Fast and Furious roller coaster. Apparently, it's gonna be pretty cool. I've heard some interesting things about it. Like, one might wrap around one of the escalators, which would be a wild thing to incorporate into the hillside. A roller coaster that goes around one of the escalators? Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely. 
Also dangerous. Also dangerous? You think it's dangerous? I mean, it could be, potentially. We are back in the wizarding world of Harry Potter because we didn't go on any rides while we were here. We just ate, and now Jacob wants to go on a ride. What ride are we aiming for here, Jacob? I, I, I wanted to try and hit the roller coaster with Luke, because he was really excited about it, but I also really want to go on the actual Harry Potter ride, and we thought we had an hour left, and we have 20 minutes. So which one's it gonna be? So, I think we're gonna try and make it to both. Okay. So we're starting with Flight of the Hippogriff, and hopefully we'll get into the Hogwarts one also. What did you think of that? Yes. Yeah, that was fun? Yeah, it was fun. Uh, really just like 12 minutes. Duncan is tall enough for that ride, but just barely. So they always check him at every height check and he passed everyone like everyone was like oh yeah no problem no problem no problem we got to the last one they're like no he can't ride and we're like oh really and they're like well let me check with my supervisor and the supervisor came over and was like yeah of course he, he's totally tall enough and so then he went on the ride but we had a little scare at the very end that he was not going to get to go on but he went on and it was fun and he's tall enough and that's good Since they're doing Halloween Horror Nights, the park closes a little early, so we are now in the Universal City Walk. It's sort of like a little mall thing. It's not that little, it's pretty big. Just adjacent to the park. This is where we're having dinner tonight, but our reservation's not for like another hour. So now we're just hanging out at the City Walk. I did want to show something. Duncan has some news. What's your news? I have a guy tooth. Oh, yeah, that tooth is just about, let me see a, just a smile. Let me just see a smile. This tooth, wait, right let's see there. it. That tooth right there, almost out. Almost ready to come out. It has been wiggly all day. And he very intentionally ate a lot of corn on the cob today. He had that's like, how I got it so wiggly. That's how he got it so wiggly. How many corns on the cob did you have? Three. Three, all by himself. And they were big ones. It wasn't a little happy. It was like a whole corn it's on the like cob. This, this big. He even took one to go. He was like walking around. Universal chewing on a corn on the cob. It's pretty funny. Yeah. Then we went on the pet ride and we and I ate it all before we went on. It's great. Our table now. We're at our table now. What are you ordering, Jake? Uh, I am ordering a burger. What kind? It's got an egg in it. And Is it the French one? French one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that one on the menu. That looked good. We're trying to do a cool shot. 
Uh, it's uh, uh, unnecessary. The pro no, it's the proper display oh, on Jacob's yeah. birthday. Okay, okay, okay. Of food and this All is right. food and filmmaking. It's gotta be done right. Way better. Way better. Excellent. Wait, wait, I have an idea. birthday <laughs> So we are in the parking lot because we are heading home. I had a really fun day. I'm excited that I got to go to the like chocolate factory restaurant and yeah. So I'm, I, I did it. I survived another year. I'm pretty proud of myself. 